Hello and welcome back to 0.15 and my fancy death world. Um, so, we have some things to do. We have some things to do. Uh, we need a bunch of turrets and a bunch of wall. We have about 700 wall in this chest. Um, let's get some more transport belt. Um, turrets and inserters. Turrets and inserters. I want to move the wall. I want to move this wall further out. Let's put this in here. Put some transport belt in there. Let's put some inserters there. Do we have... Ah. Ah. Very interesting. This is very good. This is very good. I haven't checked this out before. But we have some power poles that we also need. We have 50 here. 25 of those should be enough for a while. The downside to this design is that it's going to be slightly dark here in the middle. There is a fix for that, though. I was thinking about that before. Maybe we should... Um, um, let's cut these trees down uh, as well. Uh, it's gonna take a while for these robots to get done. Maybe we should make some of these other electric poles and um, I want to primarily use them instead. Oh, we have another 94. Uh, this wall, we can move that up to the other one together with these robo ports because we're gonna want to um, Expand our RoboPort domain. Good. We have some wall. We have turrets. Uh, we don't need that many ourselves, so let's put some in here. Uh, put these there. The robo ports. Again, more of the inserters. We only have one network now. Good. Um, did we put that in the blueprint book? Base essentials. Um, I'm thinking though, let's see, what if, no, unfortunately no. Um, let's just do like this. Let's 
just have some in here. That's going to be totally fine. And then we'll place another one here. It's going to be a bit excessive and more power lines, but I think we'll need the extra light. It's just going to be very good. It's going to be, it's going to feel good. So. We have this. Let's take a blueprint of this wall. I don't want any lamps, storage chests, or robo ports, but I want everything else. Basically, I want you to plop it down over here. Cool. Easy expansion. Very easy expansion. Then we get this done. Um, did I just destroy the deconstruction planner? Um, Let's get rid of everything here. Let's also get this running in this general direction. feed those. Good. And now we kind of killed the power here. There we go. Good. Need more of that. Also need a bunch of more lights. Let's place that down there. And ammo is coming through. Good. Let's do this. Probably don't need too many lights. This is not going to be perfect. Lighting is not going to be. Or maybe it will be quite good. This is an excessive amount of lights, but this will be quite good. There will be some small dark spots here. Let's see. You should be here with some lights. There we go. Now, 
not even sure why we have that. Let's make a blueprint of this. We don't want any pipes. We don't want that. We don't want that. We don't want that. We want tiles. I think we'll... Uh, We'll go like this. Then theoretically, we should be able to do like this and just extend the bus. Good. Let's put that into the blueprint book. Base essentials. This is going to be main bus. Good. We have tileable robo parts and everything else that we need. So we need to move the smelting area. Basically, what we want to move is this. We want to build a big chunk of things. Stuff and things. Right here somewhere. Um, let's remove these for a second so I can just take a look at this let's plop that out there I will run the outputs up here See, let's grab some power from up here. Let's deconstruct some more trees. We can just deconstruct all of these, honestly. So this first area here will pretty much be unused for now. Um, after we have mined this copper, I think I'll build a, a an electric smelting area up here. That's gonna suit our needs better. Hopefully that's gonna be a thing. But for now, so basically we should make this gear set up. We should make that here, where I stand right now. So this would that's very interesting. Let's also grab some of this, connect that with that. Very good. So we're going to see, we're going to have copper from the first.
Honestly, that doesn't quite matter. I think we should have iron from the first two. Can run that up here somewhere. Um, there we go. Apparently I am out of belt. We need a ton of inserters. Furnaces of all kinds. Gear production is basically at a standstill. Because we're not using any for research right now. Mining productivity seems useless. Solar energy. Logistics 2. We're going to need this. This is not running because of no batteries. I shut that production off completely. Um, transport belt, though. Oh, and inserters. There should be a ton of inserters laying around. Let's make... Ah, we're gonna need a some more than that. Let's grab some circuits. You can also grab gears because well we have them on on stockpile so we have 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Then we're gonna need to make a hundred normal inserters ish. It's gonna be quite a lot of crafting. Anyway, let's connect this. There we go. Now we have iron. Um, this setup here is going to have to be copper. So let's connect this. There we go, that's connected. Then we have bricks and steel, which is gonna be these two. Can make a small thing like this. We don't really care which one is which. We just care that they get connected somewhere. And as it happens, it fits pretty well to connect them there. So now what we what we need to do here is just connect this. But we're not quite ready for that yet. 
We need to make sure that we're making some essentials before. We're gonna need gears first. Let's set this up. So we make this. Right, we can... Um, plop the inserters in here. I can get my fast inserters back. Let's get some more transport belts. Transport belt, underground belt, splitters. I probably have too many splitters at this point. This is a hundred and seven thousand left. We're really starting to um, take whatever's left. So let's use some real power poles. Let's also grab some power from there so we can see how this so the problem with this is that it's gonna overlap one. which is going to be hmm that's a problem i did not expect or think of How can we creatively solve this? Well, for example, we can do like this. I think this might be the most interesting way to solve this. Try this again. Let's plop that down there. that down there put a belt in between then we grab some things from a belt which is here Hmm. 
really. Somehow we have one underground vault. Not there, not there. Then we have this again. Then we have one, then we have four, and this should come down here. Then we have one, then we have four, and four. So gears in this setup should be these two belts. Or we can have coal and stone there. And we can just use one, two, three, these two instead. This does not look terrible. Does not look terrible. Well, we're gonna find some design as we go along. This is gonna be fine for now. So we need 25 more furnaces. Twenty five more furnaces. And we need a bunch of steel for that. Ten. Twenty. And five. Um, so lubricant, we're probably not using this setup either. So I think it's time to deconstruct this. Okay. Good. Then we can probably deconstruct this as well. There we go. Finally. I can go and put these in myself. There's not that many of them. There we go, some more. So the setup is basically complete. Um, I want let's make this proper. So we're going to have two iron outputs here means that these are going to be iron. We will run a double iron belt here. I think up to this point. Um, coal. We need coal here. We can do coal like this. So 
So double iron belt. And then coal. Coal will be up here. And then we are also going to need copper. There we go. So, um, <laughs> let's deconstruct this. I don't feel like doing this manually, so let's not do that. There we go. That shouldn't be a problem. Well, we're going to have to figure out something that looks a bit better here later. There we go. Looks kind of weird. Honestly. Ah, we will figure something out. Good, we can remove these power poles. So something that we have not done before is run coal on the bus. I am not 100% convinced that there is a need to run coal on the bus. But I think I will do it just in case. And now we're out of transport belts. And then I will also run stone on the bus. Not 100% convinced that it's needed. But I will just to make sure that I think it might be useless. But we can always remove it later. This was not at all where I was going. I need transport belt. Need transport belt. There we go. So this will be steel because we will bleed off iron here. Good. That means this will be stone. Let's just run that on the bus. Just get it over with. Um, let's run that there, then we run the coal here. So then we have everything 
that I could possibly ever want. I think. From my bus. At least for now. We have a good starting thing to work with. Anyway, this has been a very long episode. Um, thanks for watching and have a nice day.